Hey guys, and welcome back to XCOM. When we last left off, we'd made it to the final stretch of the alien city. So, let's continue. Now, this map is a little bit of a pain because I don't remember it being dark. I'm really confused. I did dole out some light sticks, I'm sure. Oh, right. He's... It, <laughs> he's he's here. But he's unconscious. That's kind of cute. Right. Light him up. So we can see a little aquatoid alien straight off the bat. Well, let's uh, introduce him to pain. Shall we? Well, that sounded like a couple of them. Yeah, they don't want none of this. Let's end the turn, see if anything else turns up. They don't want none of this. They are literally fighting for their survival then. And so are we. We're holding on. Alright. Iron Maiden. Move up, buddy that up. Give that a hock over there. Okay. Let's get some dudes ready. Let's get some more dudes ready. Let's see if anything's going to come our way. Cameo, put a fresh round in. We're definitely going to lose the tank here. There's no doubt about that. But we're going to hold on to her for as long as we can. Because she is... Uh, she is the, our best scout. Okay. Looks clear. Start moving guys in. This is where we go for maximum aggression. Not that we've ever showed the aliens anything but maximum aggression. Oh, crap. One thing I forgot to mention, guys. We can save it. We can... Right, that's part of the mod then. Okay. Because... Um, in the original game... To make this just that extra bit harder... You couldn't save on the final floor. Uh, the save was greyed out. So... That's interesting. Right, who's got a med kit here? Jill? Yeah. Jill, go wake his ass up. If you can use medkit, there's nobody there. You're you're on his corpse, Jill. All right. We can use um, stimulants to wake them up, but it's not. It doesn't always work 100% of the time. Wow. There's some serious action going on. Right, one second, guys. And we're back, guys. Sorry about that. Uh, uh, I had my neighbor come down. Um, and he wanted a power supply for his PC. So <coughs> I gave him one to test. Um, and he was down for about two and a half hours just talking about PC shit. So I have no idea where I was. God damn it. Oh, yes. So, final part to left. Let's keep exploring. Ooh, who is that? So, it looks like a little lobster man. Right, well, hide in the corner. Now, weapons free on the pulse detonators. Let's go. Jimmy, take the first shot. Five. Six. Just about. See if that's going to... Ooh. That was good. That was good. 
Put another fat slug in that thing, Jim. Now, who's next? Cameo. <clears throat> Weapons free. Now, she's really quite injured. That's okay. You don't have to survive, Cameo. You just have to take this thing out for us. Right. It's taken two. It shouldn't be able to take another. Let's double check that everyone is healed, aren't they? A little bit paranoid about that. Yeah, everyone's stabilized. That's fine. Um, Ada. <clears throat> right. Well, let's get you out of the way a minute. And fire. We should. Now, what we should really be doing here is using molecular control to take over all of the aliens. Oh, just went slightly wide. That's okay. We have more. We do have more. Could you actually? I have time units. Can't quite take you to 30. No, you can't quite get there. Uh, do we have any other disruptor dudes? No, we should have five, but of course we lost Eggman, didn't we? Yeah, Barry Burton's loaded and ready to go. Barry. <clears throat> Barry, you know what to do. I have this. Right. Do you now, Bazza? Can you thread that needle? I want you to impact it on that wall there. There we go. Target scratched. Right, let's see. Well, we've bloodied them. We're coming for them. There will be no prisoners this day. I don't know if you can go for a 100% wipe on this mission. Uh, I'd have thought so. Not enough time units. Now, this mission, from what I can remember, uh, it's like very mazy. I think. Um, yeah, I think it just like spirals around. Uh, I can't really remember. But one thing I would show you is the map doesn't work on this mission. Which I did wonder if that was going to be fixed as well, but no. I guess not. Uh, due to the patch. I mean, it wasn't fixed because it was a bug. It was just like you couldn't use the map, I guess. <coughs> I guess um, you were just too far down. Let's move everybody forwards. Because the tank's going to go first. And if the tank sees anything we can shoot, we will shoot it. I'm not expecting, you know, this to be that difficult, to be fair. I don't remember this mission being particularly difficult. The only thing that will really ruin our day is if we get a pulse detonator cannon launch and just rip us a new one. But hopefully that's not going to happen. Right, everybody can hang back for now. And with any luck... We can chill. Okay, good stuff. Uh, what I would like... Right, there's a lobster man. Let's get you around here. Okay, that's fine. I don't know what that guy's armed with. Uh... Yeah, we can't... Okay, that's fine. Th okay, because because of the nature of this, this is just all one slinky corridor, which is actually really nice. Because the enemies can only come at us from one way. There's no confusing doors. Actually, that's a lie. There is lots of confusing doors. But it's not as confusing as it could be. Let's get you to hang back. Barry. Uh, I don't know if I want to hammer this guy. Yeah, this guy hasn't actually been rearmed. I don't know if I want to hammer this guy. To be honest. Yeah, he can't. With um, s missiles. Not from kind of like this far back. I mean, we could, I guess. Why not? 
Barry's loaded, ready to go. I just don't want to accidentally wing any of our guys. And especially don't want to wing the tank. Which it hasn't done. So actually, we can legitimately do this. Um, Ada. Fire. Now, if we can start killing these guys with two shots, that would be nice. Yeah. That's what I didn't want to happen. Oh well. I'm just going to have to take it a little bit slower. Be a little bit more careful. Ass. Now we don't know if this guy is actually still there. Around the corner. Oh! Look at that back. You can sit there and guard. Don't want to group anybody up too much. Because we really <coughs> don't want uh, missiles flying. In our general direction. Which would be really bad. I don't think there's any doors behind us, to be honest. I mean, his um, morale is slightly frayed, which is not great. These guys... I guess can kind of hang back for now. Because as good as the pulse launchers are, they're not really needed at the front. To be honest, what have you got? I can move you guys up a little bit. Would cut down on waypoints, I suppose. Yeah, it's kind of annoying to move everybody like one by one, but old game design. Jimmy, let's get you over here, buddy. There we are. Really not looking forward to this. I don't know where that bloody lobster is. Well, I've got an idea where he is, but oh, I really didn't want to lose my tank. Our tank is like our ace in the hole. Jill, go sit your ass over there, love. Leon, take that corner. Let's get you there, Gab. Oh, can you throw? You actually can. Sort of, but not really. That's not that useful, really. Okay, uh, now the hammer guys can take up position here these guys start moving in. Iceman, around the corner please buddy. Jimmy fails, up against the wall. Barry, up against the wall. Uh, Iron Maiden, creep forwards. Cameo, this way. Now I don't want to group everyone up too much because an unlucky shot from one of their disruptor guns <clears throat> will cause us to have a pretty bad time, to be honest. But I'm not sure how likely that actually is to happen. Come on, come on, come on. I can't believe it's actually dark down here, though. Honestly, I really did think that this was a, a brightly lit mission. Oh! Oh! He's now unconscious. Oh, that's actually quite nice. What was he equipped with? Oh. Okay. Cool, I guess. Alright, Gab, I need you to move in. Everybody, this is going to take a long ass time to get around here. But that's okay. We have nothing but time. Although it's running out for these alien bastards. Uh, right. Hammer guys. 
Yeah, I can go up here now. Did we check what this dude had? Yeah, these guys have all got stun guns. Which ain't too bad. Now she... Just stay back here, just in case anything bad happens. Everyone else, keep pushing forwards. Now, the actual lore of this game is... This ship, from what I can understand, that we're on now, Teleth, actually crashed into Earth uh, and wiped out the dinosaurs. <clears throat> or it came in with the meteor or something. And it's been here ever since. So these aliens are much older than mankind. And maybe even seeded the human race on Earth. And here we are. Getting ready to wipe their asses out. Let's get Gab. Take a look. Ooh. Now we're getting to some doors. Now we're getting to some doors. Right, we need people to start getting stacked. We could send some pulse detonators through. But the doors are quite useful because they will eat up the alien time units. Which is nice. But then obviously they will eat up our time units as well. <clears throat> I'm not sure how big this map is. Okay. I, it's not massive. It's big enough. But it's not huge. Right. Hold on to your butts. Come on. Nice. Okay. That's not a door. But that's a door. Okay. Anybody could come out of this place. And just start laying the smack down on us. Hypothetically speaking. Okay, so we've got a door in here. <coughs> is definitely not going to lead anywhere but this door down here is going to be where we need to go I would wager that door sounded close Ooh. oh no tentacolants ah no <sighs> fuck okay that's cool uh Kill that shit. Iceman, you know what to do. Iceman. Uh, right, uh, clear the lane, guys. This count, this is, uh, oh, that sneaky bastard. Clear the lane. Uh, one of those impacts there. Trouble is, the zombie um, is the problem. Iceman. Okay, now we've opened it up. That's actually a good thing. Uh, we're going to have to nuke it. We don't have a choice. Impact there. And just hope everyone's far enough away from the blast. And it opens some doors as well. Okay. So there are 
fucking brains down here. <clears throat> I don't know how many brains. One's too many. Somebody pick that light up. Nugget, you will be missed. Alright, Iron Maiden. We need some light down here. Light them up. Don't know what's through there. This is a really um, dirty, dirty area to fight. <sighs> uh, she's gonna have to keep piling guys out. Because the trouble is, because it's so windy and you're so pincered in, you just have to push forwards. You have to be very aggressive on this map. Which I don't mind. I quite like the fact you have to move fast and be aggressive. In a way. But it is sketchy as well. It's really worrying because there could be tens of coolants fucking anywhere. Look at how horrible this is to navigate and try and survive. It's not nice. Iceman, take up a position. And we look the oh, it's so dark as well. So bloody dark. One tentacle link can literally ruin us right now. Uh Jill. Jill's got lights. Light them up, Jill. It's not brilliant, but I guess it'll have to do. Everyone else? Pile in. At least there's only really one way to go. So there's that. Cameo, load up. Uh, right. Hammer team, move in. Need all of you guys ready to drop the hammer as soon as it's needed. Okay. Ooh, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. We can handle those. Fuck off. Jill, ready another flare. Light this place up best you can. Okay. Um, these boys have a good look round. Watch those fricking corners, guys. Cover fire is your friend. Friendly fire is not friendly. Nothing there. Good. Right, so that's as wide as the map is, I guess. Could still be... Yeah, there's still space for rooms here. And that goes down... How far down does it go? It goes down to here. Okay, so you see what I mean? It's not huge, but because it's so complicated... It's so... Ooh. Emma's gone. She was a good soldier. And it's destroyed the bloody light as well. Who's injured here? Let me guess. All of you. Yep, you're injured. You've got three fatal wounds. So, Iceman, you have to be healed or you're dead. Iceman... You need to be healed now, or you're dead. I mean, you have, like, no health anyway. 
Use med kits. Oh, right. Who are you? John. John's got no wounds. Jill. Jill's got one wound, so she's going to have to drop that. Go sit over here. John, can you go heal Jill, please? Ah, oh, you've already got med kit anyway. <laughs> That's fine. Heal. So, that was bad. That was really bad. We're dropping like flies. But that's okay. We can turn some hammer guys into combat troops if we need to. If we need to. We may need to. Iceman. Right. Iceman, go sit down over there. Jill, ready your flare. And next turn, we're going to have to use that. Those bloody disruptor pulse launchers are vicious. Absolutely vicious. Clear. Oh. Absolutely horrifying. John, drop that. Oh, hello. John, melt his ass. Yes, just like you did with the Covenant. I mean, Jill's okay. She's wounded, but she's okay. Painful. Anybody through here? Doesn't look like it yet. Oh. Okay. Also, look what weapon he has. He's got the fun gun. How easy would it be to navigate a torpedo? Round here. Right, it can be done. It's not easy, but it can be done. Can be done. If it can be done, it will be done. Barry? You're up. Don't fuck this up, Barry. Barry fucked it up. Remember when I said don't fuck it up, Barry? You fucked it up. Okay. We're running out of these as well, believe it or not. We took so many. And we're actually slowly but surely running out. <sighs> Come on. Come on. You need to take this dude out. Ada. I mean, he shouldn't be able to survive another one. I say he shouldn't be able to survive another one. Whether he will or not is another story. I guess we're not going to find out. He's probably going to return fire on us, and it's going to hurt. Okay. Interesting. Three fatal wounds now. Oh, 
No idea why it didn't use the disruptor gun, but I'm glad it didn't. Iron Maiden. If you could. Oh. This possibly is the right way to go. I don't know. This is the tricky maze like bullshit with this mission. In fact, yes, I think that's a dead end. Yeah, my dead end sensors are tingling. Crap. Right, so this was just like a trap room. This is the right way to go. So I'm, I think we've got to go all the way down here. And then there's a big chamber here that we have to deal with. Shit. That's okay. That is okay. Double check, guys. Make sure there's nothing here. We don't want any nasty surprises sneaking up on us. You get some cover, please. Clear. Okay. Um... All right, everybody else, start piling around. Who do you mean everybody? Everyone. Right, so we're going to regroup up here. Took some nasty wounds. But unfortunately, that's the way it goes. With XCOM. Always seem to get fucked. Even on the good days. I don't mean the good kind of fucked. I mean proper fucked. Okay. Right. So, those guys can keep holding back whilst the rest of the squad turns up. This is like Space Hulk, though, this is. This is like really Space Hulk. Although, not quite that tight, I guess. Now, the worst case scenario here would be another tentacle. Uh, these hammer bros can start piling in here. you never know when you need disruptor pulse cannons. Unfortunately, the disruptor pulse cannons uh, aren't doing us a huge amount of favours. Not really. We really should have brought more lights. Who has lights? None of you guys. At you. Nope. Chemical flares, anybody? Shit, I thought we brought more. Okay, uh, there's nothing we can do. If we ain't got them, we ain't got them. That's just the way it is. Just keep advancing. Right, Iceman. I'm kind of curious to see who's going to survive this, to be honest. I mean, this has been really messy. I guess those guys. You've got a flare. Throw it to Jill. Jill, pick it up. Right, they're running out of energy now, which is a pain in the ass. So not only do you have time units, but you've got to be careful with the amount of energy you're expending. Right. And 
Izumu does not like being alone. Can't say I blame her or him. It's kind of savage. Now, I don't know who's going to be first to open that door. I don't think we're going to have too many volunteers. And I think we need a couple of turns to rest as well. Because you do need to rest your soldiers. They run out, start running out of energy. That's really bad. Okay. Hammer team. Uh, this is just a horrible place to have to fire any shots through. It really is. Ooh. <laughs> oh, that was good. <laughs> Lit him up like the 4th of July. Jesus. I think he had uh, a bit of surprise as he opened that door and his face was instantly melted by, what was that, five hardened soldiers. Humanity's finest. And there he is, just like a bubbling puddle of dog shit. Nice. Good work, man. Good work. Anyway, guys, I'm going to have to leave it there because we're on half an hour. We're on nearly 40 minutes, actually. So, thanks for watching, guys. When we come back, hopefully we're going to keep pushing through slowly, inch by inch. That's the name of the game. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. And as always, till next time.